talk about the CIA shutting your movie down, just the subversiveness of the whole thing. They didn't want any of that. They hate. They hated pot smokers. They hated hippies. You know, Nixon hated them. You could do a whole podcast on why he made pot illegal because he was beat Nixon and all that. And the hippie. He wanted to just completely squash all of those people. So you know, it's proven now. Like you know, there's reports and books that come out that have proven the CIA were drugging people around that time. You know, Manson was one of them with LSD, making them try to recruit people, and the CIA was just trying to do mind control experiments and all of them, and just see what the fuck they could do, just fucking with people. And that's all proven now. And it's just like it just doesn't, you know, surprise me that you know, it's nothing for them to want to squash your film. You know, they could do all that crazy shit. It's just sad. My film was easy to squash. I mean, the, the attorney, all he had to say was, uh, we ain't gonna give this much distribution, yeah. Yeah, they had no vested interest anyways, really. So that's combined with that, it was a no-brainer. And that's just sad. So that's what, you know, Chris and I want to hopefully get it its proper yeah. due. I want to bring awareness to it, you know? I, I got just really pissed with the way they were gonna not distribute the movie and the way they did it was really nasty i said to them well you're gonna have telly and uh burgess meredith go up to boston i said no and uh i said how's it gonna open the only trailer they put up there was in the theater that it was gonna open in i mean it was a, a destruct job anybody wants to know how to destroy a movie come to me i'll tell you how you know, it makes you pissed when you, you know, I dive into this movie, you learn a lot about it, you watch it, and you enjoy it. It's a great film, and I've seen 10,000 other films that are just giant turds and got way more distribution. Absolutely. Absolutely. And it's like, what the F? You know, it's just, it's very unfair. When they did the truck scene, everybody says, well, how much of this truck scene are you going to use? And I said, I don't know, I'm going to wait and look at it. So I looked at it on two cameras, and, uh, you know, it was okay, it took 15 seconds. And I looked at it at the slow-mo camera, which is in the helicopter. And I went, wow. So I'm gonna keep the whole fucking thing. <laughs> oh, yeah. Runs a minute. I think it runs longer. I think it runs for yeah. almost two. <laughs> almost yeah, two probably. minutes. I mean, it just rolls yeah. and rolls. Actually, that's another groundbreaking thing you kind of did in that movie. I mean, it had been done before, but there's several just music videos in that movie. You know what I mean? Like you did like oh, yeah. several full, they're basically like music video segments, you know, way before music videos, but they've done that in movies before, but you have, I think like three of them in the movie. I just love the, how experimental you were with the film. I mean, even like Dustin was saying, all the, the stuff about CIA and MK Ultra and all that stuff that was really going on at the time. There's hints of that kind of in the movie. I mean, there's even one scene in the movie that's like so brief. It's right before you attack Telly Savalas and you put the gun in his face, where Telly Savalas is getting out of the car and there's this weird overlaid shot of Telly Savalas in the mental institution with the straight jacket on and he's rolling around yeah, yeah, on the wall. Yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah. you're like, wait a minute, is the government like using MK Ultra on him? Is he like programmed somehow to kill? Like, what's going on here? <laughs> you know, like, yeah. like, I mean, it's. But that's what I like about it, you know? Um, I love, too, how it's vague, right, Chris? Like, you're not sure, like, is the FBI, CIA, police? What the fuck? Oh, you don't know who like, he is. Yeah, he never yeah, says who he is. He never yeah. says if he's what organization he works for. You got to remember, in my brain, the grenade went off. Sure. Right, right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So it said to me, well, I can do whatever I want. I mean, I can make a jail white if I want the jail white, and I can be the only one in it. Yeah. And everybody will say, what the hell is a white jail if he's in it alone? Yeah. I don't give a fuck. I mean, you know, that's what happens when yeah. you, it isn't real. <laughs> I just thought of another music video, by the way. There's a music video when you're swimming naked in the with the naked girls oh, yeah. in the pool, too. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, there's a couple music sequences. Who the hell put a dream sequence in as a... Me, you got a yeah, pool. Yeah, yeah. Are you yeah. kidding? You can tell you wanted that in there. Oh yeah, I loved it. I'm kidding? sure you did. I'm sure you did. Angela. Yeah.
till night Oh, Angel, I knew Gonna see you tonight Don't you hide the moon If we can use your flying broom Find some